So I wanted to share with you all, I got this Miller toaster, which appropriately should be pronounced Müller toaster, and I got it because I really wanted a slimline toaster that when it's stored, it's against the wall, and one that was attractive enough to leave out on the counter. Um, the reason why is because I really didn't make much toast or anything, but um, I had to be put on a gluten-free diet, and gluten-free bread, some of you know, sometimes um, just doesn't hold up to a sandwich unless it gets a good, quick toast. And so um, I wanted to show you all that, but first, a few features. Um, this toaster has a warming feature, and then it has a digital setting for up and down, which is really important for gluten-free breads. They toast very, very differently depending upon the flours and the ingredients. And then it has a defrost setting, which is really cool. I haven't had a chance to use that yet. And then if at any point you have a peak or get the sense that, hey, the cycle should be over, you press this button and it just pops right up. And so here you see the symbol for a um, little bit of warning there, not to touch the top. And so I'm going to show you first, I made a little discovery because same thing with tortillas. Now I have to have corn tortillas to give them a quick toast. And um, I have it set here on four, which is really for the bread. So that really is too high um, for the just warming a tortilla. And so I usually put that on two, but let's just say it was done. Um, of course, it will come up by itself, but um, perhaps I want to shorten the cycle. And as I mentioned earlier, you can press this button and it's all over with. And here's my nice warmed tortilla. If I left it in longer, it would, um, it would make it sort of like a taco shell. All right, but that's not the real purpose. Um, the real purpose... Uh, of course, is to toast bread. And it is wide enough for bagels or buns, if that's what you wanted to do. And some gluten-free bread, you know, comes in really, really small loaf. And the small loaves, I can actually get three slices at one time. But let's just put the two in here. And um, this is a gorgeous maple oat. And um, because it has a little bit of a sugar content, I'm going to um, pick a little bit higher setting. All right, it goes up to six. And we'll go ahead and um, I'm just gonna have you wait through all of that, but I promise that what's going to happen is just a really, really pretty, evenly toasted couple of pieces of bread, smelling delicious. And you can see that the mechanism holds it quite upright. It closes around it. And um, just really, really happy with this This is the Mueller toaster. It's the two slice one. This is my cat. Um, we have no space in our kitchen. We live in an apartment in Brooklyn. And this ingenious toaster, slim toaster, is life changing. I was making English muffins in the oven and it was horrible. And this has pretty much saved my life on multiple occasions. It's We're impeccable. Impeccable, my husband said. The best. It's got six different six different level number six you can change it this and that it's phenomenal you don't want it anymore you just press that pops up fantastic if you don't buy this you're not living As you can see, I've used mine for quite <clears throat> a few times. I love this thing. 
It's small, it's slender, and I'll tell you what, be prepared when them things come out because they fly out of there. Love it. It's a fun, actually, it's actually a fun toaster.